CS Matiangi says that there shall be no movement by air and road into and out of the county, which is on partial lockdown for an initial period of 21 days and will then be reviewed. Mandera is the first county to report cases of people escaping from mandatory quarantine under unclear circumstances. Now, this is a dangerous situation because, as you are well aware, Mandela has a lot of is, is a corner is a corner county with neighbors on two sides and is also affected by travel from uh, other parts of the country. Therefore, as part of the containment measures, the government has today restrict directed restriction of movement into and out of Mandera County. The 32 were out of 66 passengers who were placed in quarantine at a facility in El Wak after traveling from Nairobi last Wednesday. The bus was intercepted by officers on its arrival at around 8 p.m. after breaking the directive by President Uhuru Kenyatta that there shall be no movement out of or into Nairobi. In his daily brief to the nation, Health CS Mutahi Kagwe warned that any slight misbehavior among Kenyans will speed the spread of the highly contagious COVID-19. It may move at a slow pace, but as we have also seen in countries such as Spain and Italy, it takes on such frantic speed that even the most developed of nations cannot catch up with it. Between March 18th and 25th, a span of one week, the cases in Spain grew fivefold. Given these realities, the general sentiment of comfort we are witnessing is severely misplaced. Mandera now joins Kilifi, Nairobi Metropolitan, Mombasa and Kwale, which also have cessation of movement orders in place in a bid to curb community-based COVID-19 infections. We need Lubembe for Ebru TV.